Hello guys, welcome back and today I'm just going to show you the flying mechanism in Unreal Engine 5.4 In this video we will see the flying mechanism how our character will uh, fly So in the previous video I explained how we can convert or how we can uh, give the transformation to different characters like uh, this So this we did in the previous session so if you haven't seen this uh, video, just uh, go back and watch this video till the end. Then you will understand a uh, few blueprints Okay, here uh, to connect. So go back to here. Just I'm closing this. And uh, the first thing is we have to make uh, some input action here. So for that, uh, we'll have to go inside the third person character. And here you will see inputs. So inside the input action, here you will see uh, input action right look move anything like any other uh, action you want to create then you have to uh, do right click over here then you will see option input right under input action you can create but uh, if you are doing like this if you are creating the duplicate like this way also you can create an input action again so here I am just uh, saying up underscore and down up and down right so like you want to write anything you can mention so no problem at all and uh, if you want to change something then uh, you can but uh, by default uh, you will duplicate it then you will see axis 2d vector 2d or if you are taking a new action then that time you have to take this only okay so go back to here and just save it right and uh, inside the input you will see input mechanism here mapping context input mapping context to double click here then you will see uh, mapping mappings right so inside this mapping means uh, those three uh, mappings are here and uh, one more we have created so that uh, mapping uh, we have to add here input mapping so just click and uh, get that uh, which we have created so just get it here right inside this few things we have to create which is the keys right so from here we have to map the keys like uh, here i want to add x value uh, x coordination right and uh, one more we have to create and uh, from here we will say create like this and if we have added here x then uh, i'm just going to say uh, z or uh, like you uh, can press here z here i'll keep z and here i want to add the x okay so these two keys we have uh, added here and inside the modifo, uh, modifier here we have to do one more thing uh, inside that we have to add some modifier like this way and here uh, say negate okay so this is the negative negate okay inside uh, just this we have added and say save and uh, close it so we have completed these uh, options how we can create input action we understood now go back to in the third person uh, character and in the blueprint you will see the third person uh, blueprint system right so here we can like convert into a single node so i say collapse node and then uh, here we will mention the dragon underscore chtr right and this will be right this is the main character and uh, this one is the dragon node right so just get it here like this again save it or just compile it and uh, here we have added that uh, input action so that input action we will add here underscore sorry i a underscore up and down so this we have added here right and uh, this is the trait and here actually we have to use the branch node and in this branch we will add this character right character uh, movement we want to add with this so if our character is flying right so here we have to say the fly is character fly because this is the conditions right 
so just get it here and uh, connect with this right and here just get it this add moment input right inside the moment input means actually from here we are going to say the direction from which direction you want to move your character so just i want to say in the z right this will be in the z and from here if you see this is the action values do right click and say uh, split right so x along with x we will connect like this so this is done the one uh, one part right and uh, here we will add some different commands so for that command actually we will use x and y value uh, along with the mouse left uh, click right so do right click here uh, we have to add uh, the left uh, mouse command right left mouse button and here also we will use the command and that will be the first branch node okay and uh, in this branch we will add uh, this actually see our character when our character is going to fly so for that purpose we will have to add some variables here so the variable will be is flying is flying this flying i am just going to add right so this will be the get node and uh, connect with this right okay and uh, this uh, flying statement actually this node again we have to add within this right so do double click and within this uh, just say set node and uh, here we will have to keep false right and uh, go back to here in uh, this character node right here we have to say the true so again use the same command here drag and drop yes and just say enable right so these two things we have to do and uh, go back to here and now the thing is we have to say the set movement right mode for the character so this character is going to fly so here just say fly right say compile now just i want to check whether our character is moving or flying or not so this is the way where uh, i have just created go back to here in the node and uh, say alt and p right so when our character will uh, transform into the bird right like this and then our character should fly right so i am just going to press the x command and left in the button see now character is flying okay if i press x then it's going to again back to down like this and you want to fly anywhere like this see so the character is flying like this and uh, yes going up and down also so just i want to see this uh, okay just scale it okay now say alt and p okay and uh, say again uh, like character is moving like this right and if i want to add the x which is this uh, hammer okay so our character is going to move uh, when i just uh, say walk right so the character is moving like this but uh, here if you want to fly uh, the camera according to this uh, character so nothing happens see if i press x a what, whatever x and z so our character is not flying but when our character is going to transform and if you say fly then it will work like this but the problem is what see 
my character is also like uh, walking in uh, the sky so this is not the right process right so here i want to do or i want to set uh, character should walk but in the ground so when uh, our character will transform into again uh, the human character or the character then it should come back in the ground and should walk so go back to here and inside this means uh, this is the dragon right this is the character so here just i want to say i think uh, this is the mesh uh, this is the dragon so here i can see the mesh means our character is moving so here we have to set movement right so inside this just add walking now compile it go back to here and check so now just transform into the dragon just click and uh, z now character is flying yes so now automatically my character will walk and if i say jump see it is going to jump in the ground directly so it will work so i hope you understood how i did this